I'm a little bit nervous. This might end badly. Hi guys, my name is Liz Cleavy and welcome to my channel. Welcome back to my channel. If you haven't subscribed yet, don't forget to subscribe down below. Give this video a thumbs up. Turn my bell for notifications and comment down below. And follow all my social medias in the description. <laughs> In the description so you can keep up with me on my daily life and what I'm doing blah 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 and all that good stuff so for this video I will be talking about the life's a drag palette by Manny MUA the box it comes in looks like this and I actually think that it is absolutely sickening I it was upside down I um swatched this had fun with it last night on my snapchat and my Instagram stories. So if you don't follow me on Snapchat or Instagram, go follow me there for like talking about new products or just random stuff. Um, but yeah, anyways, I'm obsessed with this holographic gold like accent. I think that looks sickening. So it's upside down because I played with it last night, but I absolutely hate the cover of this. I hate it. I just think that it's not very like, unique or authentic but i just i hate it i hate it i hate this cover i think it's awful um i like the back of it i like the white with the this nice lettering i like that i feel like if he just if manny just said white with this being like life's a drag in like some print or something that that would have been a hell of a lot better than this i hate this i think it is horrible this is the inside of the palette there's 16 shades in here there is a matte neutral side and a colorful side which i like because i think that it's two different moods two different looks and that's why i'm going to do be doing one i using this side of the palette and then one i using that side of the palette because um it comes with a brush a brush looks like this it looks like that on the end and then it looks like this um i don't like it when brushes comes with stuff i don't know i feel like he just wanted to put that there but yeah that's what palette looks like i think it looks like a nice palette i swatched well mostly this side last night and i liked what i got from the swatches but you know swatches are never accurate so i'm just gonna go in and get started so i'm gonna be starting off on the neutral side and i'm gonna be going in with my favorite the morphe m200 i think i'm gonna go in the shade sickening which is right here and i'm gonna put that all over my crease and well all over only like one crease It's an eh shade. I think it's a good like tra transition shade. It's like nothing special. Blends out nicely, you know, it doesn't take a lot of effort, which I like because I don't like a lot of effort. Now we're gonna go into the shade Hunty. Put that over sickening. Yeah, so Hunty blends out pretty effortlessly as well. It blends out good in with sickening. These colors together are really nice. So she gonna call her friends and that's a Okay, so that I sickening and hunty together, I like it gives me your eye, like honestly, you could create like a bronzy look out of this. And I like that. So so far so good. We're gonna go into mug. Right there. You know, put it over it still but yeah just to give my eye a lot more color i guess I just saw the sushi from Japan. Okay, on the end it isn't like blending out that nice yeah um it's okay definitely a lot more effort so yeah this is like if you add a mug it's okay um now we're gonna add trade um more like down on my lid dropped up how we rolling no no to like blend out it even more i'm gonna go in with the morphe m441 brush to like really like get in there south beach yeah look like kelly rolling this might be my destiny she want me to eat it i guess then it's on me that you know i want to take cake face and i want to go on the inside here and I want to see what's going to happen. Oh, it's like a recipe. She just want to do it for the... So cake face, I like it. Okay, so that is cake face. Now the inside of my eyes. Now like white. We're going to go in with the Morphe M416 brush. Which I actually also use this brush a lot. And we're going to go in the shade. Shady. 
because, you know, a lot of people are showing you these days. And we're going to put this on the outside and the inside corners of my lid. But don't go in the middle. It's like a recipe. She just want to do it for the grand. She just want this money in my hand. So that shady on the inside corner of my lid. I like it. Give it to her when she dance, dance, dance. She gon' kill. Very shady on the outside as well. Okay, so now. We're gonna go into legendary and we're gonna put that in the middle of the black because this looks really wonky right now. She dance, dance, dance. She gonna catch a room out the Calabasas. She said she too young, don't want no man. So she gonna call her friends, now that's a plan. I just saw the sushi from Japan. So legendary is nice so far. I like her. She's She's doing good. So, this is this eye almost done. I just gotta do the bottom, but actually, I like it so far. I think it's good. I think that these shades that I've tried out so far are good. I mean, nothing special, nothing extraordinary, and just out of the box go, wow! Now, we're gonna take the Morphe M124 brush and go in with the shade mug and just put that under my eye. Now yo, just wanna kick it, Jackie Chan. She said she. Hey, so that is, you know, this one eye all complete. Looks a little wonky because it's the only eye that's done. But I gotta do the other. I know, duh. We're gonna go back in with the Morphe M two hundred brush and we are gonna dive into Kiki. Which is right there. I. Wow. And yeah. She too young, don't want no man. So she gon' call her friends. Hey, yeah, nothing's there. Alright, Manny. What's going on? So she gon' call her friends, now that's a plan. I just there is nothing on my face. Great. I just saw the sushi from Japan. Okay. Um, nothing there. I already dipped in like five times. Nothing there off Kiki. So, um, that's Kiki, and I think that's that that's all we're gonna get out of her. Very disappointed in this side so far. I think we're gonna jump right into pageant queen, which is that dark purple, and put that again on my crease. But we're gonna go in with the Morphe M441 brush. Okay, so pageant queen does not blend out blend out that good. I don't know how to feel about her. Okay, so Kiki and pageant queen, nothing special. I'm gonna put on more of pageant queen and see what happens. <laughs> So yeah, that is Pageant Queen. We're gonna go on with the shade Snatched and put it on the bottom outside of my crease. Okay, so Snatch is there. I like Snatch. Snatch is good. Like the first like actual good shade on this side. We're gonna take Kai Kai, put that on the inside. Wait, in the middle. We're putting her in the middle. Just cause they heard what hood I'm from. All right, Kai Kai, I like. We're gonna take Campy. We're gonna put that on the inside. Back about me, back. Just cause they heard what hood I'm from, they think I'm crazy. I think I'm crazy. Okay, we'll make. Okay, so that is Campy on the inside. And you know what? I'm not mad at this. We're gonna take fishy, you know, put it on the outside again. Like we did with Shady. And again with the Morphe M416 brush. Just a little crazy. Just a little. Cause I admit So yes, this is fishy on both sides. Now we're gonna be taking the, the same brush and we're gonna go into beat, which is right here, and we're gonna put that on the center of my lid. Just a little crazy. Just a little. Cause I made him crazy about that lady, yeah, yeah. Oh. Finger to the world, is you pay Okay, so 
could be on there and my eyes look very very different take the shade I mean the Morphe brush M124 and dip into the shade um, snatched we're gonna go with snatched on the on my the, the water line but my lower lash line whatever it's called I don't know you pay, I was slave turn the cuz I'm running out of patience Okay, so both eyes are done, and I have to say I'm not, like, mad at it. I definitely have to say that this is not a perfect palette, like, not perfect, like, Kiki and Pageant Queen could have been done a lot better, um, but I do like this palette. I feel like that you can definitely do two very different looks, and I did use every single shade in this palette, um, which actually was a unintentional I don't think I'd do that but I like it uh, the colors blend really really nice and more importantly they blend nice together and they look nice um I definitely like this eye better than this eye just because I like I've been getting more into crazy and more colorful eyeshadow looks but I do still like this eye because it's very good for winter I'm just gonna like evil <laughs> um but anyways I think that this is a nice palette it's just it's also very, very good for travel because you can definitely get a lot of different looks out of one, out of just this palette. It's very good to travel with. It's lightweight and I can definitely get two different moods out of it. So, yeah. Anyways, I do li like this palette. I think that it is nice yet again. I hate this cover. I hate this cover so much. But, yeah. Um... I do like this. I think it's nice. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the Life's a Drag palette review by Manny MUA. Um, I think it's crazy. I remember about six months ago, he announced um, Lunar Beauty and how he was like creating a brand and now he think and now he like comes out with a palette. I think that that's so sick and I'm actually really, really proud of Manny because seeing that he came out with a palette, I think that is great. So... Yeah, like, comment, subscribe if you enjoyed. Don't forget to turn on my bell for notifications and follow all my social medias in the description below. I love you guys and thank you for watching. Bye. I love you guys. Thanks for watching. I love you. Subscribe. And I love you. I just want to say that I love you. Also, thanks for 100 subscribers. Like, I meant to put this in my video before, but I just honestly like this is the end i forgot to put this in my video till now i just want to thank my dad for like literally <laughs> spending so much freaking coin on my makeup because honestly if he didn't this channel wouldn't be here so dad thank you for spending all this money on my makeup and i wouldn't be able to doing and i wouldn't be able to be doing i i don't know how to talk what i love without you so thanks dad and thank you for everything and thank you for people who subscribe who thumbs up and who watch my videos like thank you i love you and it means a lot and i will catch you guys in the next video bye